Hello everyone, this is Dimitar from the Red Mineup support team. In this video demonstration, I'm going to show you the auto replies feature of the help desk plugin. So, a few words about the feature itself. The feature means that when a client writes an email to your help desk, then an automatic answer is going to come into the client's email notifying him notifying him that the request is received into the help desk. So I'm going to show you how you could configure it and going to show you an example of such an auto reply. So the first thing that I would like to say is that this feature could be configured in two ways, in a global way and into a project level way. So to configure it in the global way, you have to go to administration on the top right corner and then plugins and then help desk. Here you will find a help desk template tab. And here is auto answer email template. So um, yeah, when the client writes to the help desk, he's going to automatically receive this text. It is hello, the first name of the client. We hereby confirm that we have received your message. We will handle your request and get back to you as soon as possible. Your request has been assigned to the following case ID. So the text here is actually up to you. And you could write anything you like. This is just an example. And here you could set uh, macros uh, that are actually very helpful for your help desk work. Uh, the macros could be found into our site, into the help desk documentation. I'm going to show it to you now. Here it is, macros, help desk macros. So uh, yeah, here is the full list of the macros. You could set, for example, ticket status, ticket ID, um, yeah, contact last name, contacts name, full name, and so on. So you could check the full list here and use the ones that are going to fit your needs. All right, so this was the global way of setting the auto answer of help desk. The other way of setting this feature is on the project level. So we select help desk project and then project level settings and then help desk template tab. Here is the auto answer email template. Here is the point that I would like to let you know that the project level settings are overriding the global ones. So if you have set only global settings, they are going to be applied for all projects. However, if you have global settings and then project level settings, these project level settings are going to be applied because they override the global pro the global settings of the auto answer template. So in our case, this auto answer is going to be sent to the client. So uh, yeah, here we have uh, option to enable or disable the auto, the auto answer. In our case, it is enabled, so the client will receive the auto answer. Okay, so we see that the auto answer is now set into our help desk. Okay, so it is enabled and the text is written. There is a public URL of the ticket uh, yeah, and quoted description of the request. So we are going to see how it works. We go to a client's email, which in my case it is the my testing Gmail. So we compose a new message and write our help desk demo email that is the demo at redmineup.com so the subject will be testing the help desk auto answer feature hi support team i would like to know more about your auto answer feature please help me 
Master of Darts. Jimita. Alright, so the message is sent and now we go into our help desk tab to get the email. Please note that in our help desk it is done in a manual way with this button. However, you could do it uh, automatically. There is a detailed guide about this. There is a video demonstration so you could check in our help desk documentation. Alright, so there is one email processed. This is our email that we have written just a couple of seconds ago. Okay, so we see that here is our ticket. Testing the help desk auto answer feature. Hi support team, I would like to know more about your feature. Alright, so let's go to the email of the client and see the auto answer that he, that he has received. And here it is, demo, Redmine help desk plugin demo support message. And here it is. Hello Demeter, we hereby confirm that we have received your message. We will handle your request and get back as soon as possible. Your request has been assigned to the following case ID. Uh, yeah, so if we go and see, this is indeed the case ID 604. Okay. So um, just let's go and see again the template. So here it is. This is the macro of the issue ID. It is applied successfully. And then there is a public URL of the ticket and then the quoted description. So um, yeah, here is the public URL. When we click on it, it is opening the public ticket view. Yeah. Here it is. Okay, and the quoted description of the message is Hi support team, I would like to know more about your auto answer feature. Please help me. So this auto answer is yeah seen by the client and it is as said before as a confirmation from the help desk system that his request is confirmed to be received and is ready for the support engineers to check it and answer to the client as soon as possible. So yeah, this is the auto answer feature of the help desk plugin. I hope uh, this video was helpful for you and if you like it, you could check other videos and articles into the help desk documentation. Thank you very much for watching this video and bye bye for now.